I, uh, I got to meet uh, your next artist, Eric Lee Beddingfield, uh, oh, about eight, nine months ago. I did a benefit at the Wild Horse Saloon uh, with Dolly Parton and and uh, crew. It was uh, it was a great cause that night. But what struck me about him is how humble he is and how talented he is. He's working with a good buddy of mine here at the Sound Kitchen. My good friend Kent Wells is producing his stuff. And because I'm absolutely blonde nat naturally, I'm going to uh, use these cheat notes if I can. Okay, uh, Nashville recording artist Eric Lee Beddingfield. He had uh, three top 40 singles on the Music Row charts, had a number one independent release, named one of the top 10 artists to watch by New Music Weekly. He's working on his next album, as I mentioned right here at the Sound Kitchen. It's coming out earlier next year. And uh, he's humble, talented, and People Magazine's sexiest man alive for this year. Ladies and gentlemen, Eric Lee Beddingfield. Gunner, you shouldn't lie like that. <laughs> Only that last thing he said was the truth. The <laughs> most valuable thing anybody can have is a home. You know, it's where their memories, their family, everything's from. And, and I'd already written this song, and, and I already told me about the event, and I, I just want to close tonight with this. It's called This Is Still My Home. But once again, y'all, thank y'all so much for being here. <laughs> My home.